Welcome to Sam Goff and Guitar. A bit of a revisit today uh, by request of one of the subscribers, one of you guys out there, um, Matteo Midas 638. Thanks for your comments, mate. Um, so he wanted me to kind of revisit the Kingsley Jester. So the Kingsley Jester is a tube driven overdrive pedal. It has a couple of little switches on there which we'll go through which kind of change the gain structure and the amount of gain and stuff we can access through it but basically it's a boost and overdrive pedal tube driven by two 12 8x sevens gotta get that right always get it wrong <laughs> right so yeah let's make a start shall we this is the amp right everything about 12 o'clock So what I'm going to start with is actually the switch at the top, okay, because that changes how much gain we've got accessible to us. At the moment it's in the middle, so it's mid-gain, right? Uh, over to the left, lower gain, over to the right, right, higher gain. So let's just move that around a little bit. Let's go back to the center, start messing around with some of these dials. So how much gain do we have? Still on the low gain setting now. Okay, let's go back to the low gain. And let's think about this as, you know, a nice low gain pedal, maybe an always on kind of thing. So off. check out how it responds to the guitar volumes as well right so just picking just picking dynamics so you can tell it cleans up really nicely right um, Let's see how much you can clean up on a higher gain setting. Pretty good, right? This is where we're at.
So you can tell it's really dynamic, right? It cleans up beautifully with the guitar volume, cleans up really nicely just with picking dynamics as well. Let's go everything back to the middle and let's just mess around with the EQs a little. So bass. So as you can tell, really powerful EQs on it, loads of range and vari uh, variation there. You can get a great sound out of any guitar. Right, let's go through this boost section quickly. So the boost, basically you've got, uh, again, a three-way switch. So you've got the fattest boost on the left, it's like a treble booster in the middle, and then a mid-range boost on to the right. So let's just see what the boost does. First of all, just without the other side turned on because it goes boost into OD, right? But let's see if we can just use it as a boost to the amp. Sounds pretty good, right? So that's just pushing the amp really nicely now. Let's try the treble booster. So into the middle. And then the mid boost. So yeah, you can definitely hear the difference. Get, again, really nice being able to kind of switch between them because otherwise you have to change out your boost pedals, right? I've got an Analog Man Beano Boost treble booster. I've got an EP booster. Sometimes you want to switch them around for different flavors. With this one, just switch them across, all good. Right, let's see how this boosts the overdrive side. So back to the drive, we're gonna go low gain again. At the Okay, let's go the fattest boost. Treble boost again. Right, let's max that boost, because why not?
sound and air. You go just a quick look through this awesome pedal um i hope that is useful particularly for you uh matteo mido 638 because you asked for it so hopefully that's that's useful guys um right cool i will see you soon got some other pedals coming soon uh, including a univibe a reverb a delay got loads of different loads and loads of different things right really excited about them so yeah take care and i will see you soon